Hello everyone. So today in this video, we are going to discuss about a new terminology that is your what is response curve. Okay, I hope few students may be knowing what is response curve. So those who are not aware of this particular terminology, we are going to discuss now. So without wasting time, let's begin. So you see what is this response curve? This is suggested by Holiday in 1960. Very very important by whom? Holiday in which year? 1960. The relationship between plant population and yield. This is known as what your response curve. That means the curve or the curve which is showing the response of the plant population towards the yield is known as what your response curve. Two type of response curves are there. One is asymptotic response curve another one is your what parabolic response curve okay so you see what is asymptotic response curve okay when entire dry matter is the economic product of as in case of your fodder crop or tobacco you take the tobacco plant or you take the fodder crop what will happen the whole plant itself is a yield yes or no this is what your asymptotic response where the entire dry matter is used as the economic product it may be fodder crop or fed to the cows or maybe tobacco plant also it means increase in plant density with increased yield that means whenever the plant more plant will come means more yield will come that is what your asymptotic response cereal crop for fodder so what is parabolic response after reaching a level increase in plant density with decrease yield Okay, that means you take cereals, you take pulses, you take uh, this rice or maize or any kind of other plants. Where what will happen? If more density will be there in a particular unit, unit area, after a time period, what will happen? The yield will be reduced. It may be due to pest attack, it may be due to overcrowding, it may be due to nutritional competition, whatever it may be. But the yield will decrease when the increase in plant density will be there. That is what your parabolic response curve. I hope you understood these things. A close functional relation between input and output will be there. You see quadratic response y equal to a plus bx plus cx. You know this thing. Linear response y equal to a plus bx. And Michel is y equal to y plus a. 1 minus 10 to the power minus kx or y equal to derivative of y by x. Uh -huh. Derivative of y. Yes or no? dy by dx equal to a minus y to the whole power c. What are these things and all if you want? Please uh, put in the comment box. We can go for a separate video regarding this all relationship and all. I hope this video will be informative for you. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Acha suno. Subscribe karte wakna ghanti bajade na. Taake jab main online aao, to tumhare phone ki bhi ghanti baje.